Thanks, Rance. So, okay, if there is a TV show that doesn't have Assistant Chief Lakeisha Burton on it regularly, I don't want to be a part of it. Okay, <laughs> that is not a show I care to be with. And <laughs> Teresa Smith of Junior Achievement is with us right now. Yes. Representing Jax Powell has been, I know, a big part of your life because you came so far in your life. And we're not going to get into the entire backstory, but yes. tell us for just a minute the mission of Jax Powell, and then we're going to get to this and these, and I promise <laughs> there's a reason. But, but yes. the mission of Jax Powell, and then we'll talk with Teresa about junior achievement. So the mission of Jax Powell is to bridge the gap between law enforcement officers and the youth in our community, and we've been doing that for over 47 years. And there is a, a method to the madness yes. here. There's a slumber party that happens every single year, DNA Unique, and that is an opportunity for teen girls in our community to meet up with some really strong role models. And Teresa, this year is the first time that Junior Achievement is a part of it. Yes. So let's talk about your mission and why this is a great fit. Yes, well, Junior Achievement, we empower students to own their economic success. And we do that by getting volunteers to teach students about entrepreneurship, as well as financial literacy and work readiness. We allow students to look at needs and what is needed in a community and how to fill those needs. And so this year, we're so excited to empower girls to own it. Own it meaning not just owning it as being an entrepreneur, but own who you are from the inside out. So own how you look, appreciate how you look, and then look at how you can be a girl boss because we are doing it and we do it well as women. So we're going to have very strong women entrepreneurs there empowering these girls to own their economic success to be successful in life. And when we say these girls, this is where you come in. If you yes. have a young lady in your life who is... Uh, between the ages of 10 and 16 10 and 16 they could be a part of this free event but it takes signing up early because you fill up to capacity yes, so let's we're talk about full already let's talk about what happens during that evening in December the yes. 6th of December yes. what happens these young ladies show up and now what? Well, first of all, we, we kick it off with a blast. Normally we do this dance, but this year we are doing Rip the Runway and we are going to model for the girls yes. and, and funny stuff like this. <laughs> but we're wearing it. Yeah, so, and, and like, like she said, we're going to have breakout sessions where they are going to really learn about entrepreneurship. And at the end of the night, they will create their own business and show it to all the rest of the girls. And, you know, it's a night of excitement. We got candy, food, and movies. And uh, listen, Adult women, we kind of transition to little girls as well. So it's just a night to really empower girls and really give back. So when uh, when the morning comes, you have no voice, I'm guessing. <laughs> You're going to get a crabby girl back because every girl who has a sleepover doesn't sleep. We know yes, that to be yes. true. But also we're going to see you guys rocking the runway. So uh, just within the confines of our table, can you show me a few of your, you, I know you've been working on it. Yeah. Yeah, and see with these, it just, it just works. It yeah. just totally does work. <laughs> Have you, uh, how many years has this been now? Uh, this will be the fifth year. So you've no doubt heard from some young girls who have since graduated the program. Yes. And what have they said looking back? Yes. Oh, let me tell you what parents say. After that night, they come and say, what did y'all do? My daughter, she's, you know, excited, her self-esteem, and, uh, and the girls, they love it. And I tell you, when we opened up on October 1st, we're, uh, we were like 75 people within an hour. So these girls are coming back. They're thrilled to see police officers. Mm -hmm. they, they, they are able to humanize us, and they can't believe that we know how to dance. So... Um. <laughs> and not just yes. any police officers, right. you ladies are, you know, you, you guys are a lot of fun. So yes. we have a, a, a few moments left to tell everybody where to go to sign up for the event. Right. So where do they go to do that? JaxPal.com. Okay, there you go. So easy. And do yes. it very soon. And yes. thank you for what Please. you're doing because you're, oh, you're you. this is our future we're it talking is. about. Right. We're going to be right back with more River City Live. Okay.